Hi, my name is Randy Bram, and I'm a repair technician for WNH Impex. Today, I'm going to introduce you to the cycle programs of the Lexus Sterilizer. Now, let's look at the Lexus Sterilizer cycle programs, loading the chamber, and how to run a cycle. The Lexa has six FDA approved cycle options for various loads. It's easy to navigate the two pages of cycle options by pressing the left or right arrows. The cycle options are pouches, medium load, pouches, large load, pouches, and wrapped cassettes. Wrapped cassettes, unwrapped, and low temperature. The Lexa has the ability to have custom cycle options. To activate the three custom cycle options, tap the menu button, then device settings, and cycle exclusion. Here you can also remove or add cycles depending on your clinic's needs. Tap the right arrow to see the three custom cycles available. Please note that these cycles are not approved by the FDA. The custom cycles will appear on the main screen. The custom cycle options are as shown. This information can be found in the Lexa instructions for use. Tap your custom cycle of choice, then tap the settings icon. From here, you can change the sterilization time and the drying time. Please note that the default drying time is the minimum value permitted and cannot go below that value. There is the possibility to start a cycle later if needed. When loading the pouches, it's important to load pouches paper side up. This facilitates drying during the Lexus vacuum assisted drying cycle. It's also best practice to not overlap your pouches. Load wrapped instruments on the Lexa tray inserts. Again, best practice is to not overlap any pouches or pack items on top of one another. To initiate a sterilization cycle of the Lexa, close the front door and select the desired cycle. If the user has any questions on which cycle to choose, they can refer to the cycle card that comes with Alexa. Press the start icon to initiate the auto door locking and cycle execution. After pressing the start icon, the door locks automatically and the cycle starts. The remaining cycle time will appear. Press stop any time to abort a cycle. Please note that when aborting a cycle, the load might not be sterile. Audible beep tones signal when the cycle is complete. Press open to unlock the chamber door and remove the load. Remember, the load will be hot. Use the tray removal tool to remove the trays. When selecting a cycle, the user has the option to change the drying time. Before pressing the start button, press the settings button. Then press drying time. Use the arrows to change the drying time. You can check the box to make the new dry time a default for your cycle. There is also the option to start a cycle at a later time. Confirm your settings and then press the start button to begin the cycle.
Prior to cleaning the Lexus sterilizer, it's important to ensure the chamber is not hot. Do this by switching off the Lexa and allow time to cool. Once a month, you will need to clean the Lexa. Keep in mind there is no cleaning cycle. The cleaning cycle is a manual process by wiping down the Lexa with a clean microfiber cloth. Take a clean microfiber cloth and wet with clean water. To start, remove the trays from the rack of the chamber. Wipe down the Lexa chamber and any other surfaces. You do not need to use a cleaning solution to clean the chamber. Clean water only. Once you've cleaned the chamber, unscrew the three chamber filters. Remove by rotating counterclockwise. Rinse under clean tap water and replace the filters. Be careful not to damage the temperature probe located in the back of the Lexa chamber. There are two consumable parts on the Lexa sterilizer. The HEPA filter, located here, and the door gasket, located here. Both consumables are replaced every 1200 cycles, which is approximately every 12 to 18 months, depending on your cycle usage. A reminder message appears 50 cycles prior to the actual replacement message to allow time to order the replacement consumables. Press X if you do not replace any consumable, or press checkmark if you replace the consumable immediately. A reminder message appears 25 cycles prior to the actual replacement message. Click on the movie icon to view a brief video on how to replace each consumable. Note that the part number for each consumable will appear to help in the reorder process. Both consumables are replaced every 1200 cycles, which is approximately every 12 to 18 months, depending on your cycle usage. Please note, it's important to replace consumables in time when related messages appear to avoid sterilizer malfunction. Replace the HEPA filter by unscrewing the filter counterclockwise. Replace with the new filter and screw clockwise until snug. To replace the used door gasket, remove the old gasket off the chamber door. Mount the new gasket starting at the 12 o'clock position, then 6, 9, and 3. Ensure the door gasket is properly mounted, fully seating into the groove. A door gasket not fully seated can cause steam leaks, sterilizer malfunction, and even personal injury. Thanks for watching the Lexa cycle programs and maintenance of the Lexa Dental Sterilizer by W&H. If you would like to learn more, please visit our webpage.